About 10 years ago, I was down in Guatemala and I came across one village where there was no rubbish and I couldn't believe the, where was all the rubbish in this little village because South and Central America, as most people know, as in a lot of the world, has a lot of rubbish. And this one little village had nothing. And I asked some of the local people, where, where's your rubbish? How come you have such a clean village? And they pointed to the walls, these beautiful walls that had all murals painted on them. And they said, see those walls? They're made of plastic bottles filled with rubbish. And I couldn't believe it. And I, I went and I found out more. And sure enough, they'd built all these walls that were made totally from a bottle which was filled with plastic and polystyrene and batteries and all of the landfill rubbish had been put inside the bottle. So I then carried on a few years later and took this first to Ecuador and we built some restaurants and a, a workshop space for the Committee of Human Rights and since then it's been travelling around the world this project in places where there's real problems with rubbish and not just in where there are problems but anyone can do this. You just get a plastic bottle, put all the rubbish into the plastic bottle. If it's too large, you can just cut it up and put it in. Just stick it in with a stick or a wooden spoon until it's really hard. And when it's compressed, then it's a brick. It's an eco block. So from that, we have different methods. We can tie it up and use render, adobe or cement. So I've, there's a lot of pictures which are a lot easier to, to explain and I've also got links on my website, Eyes of Gaia. This came from an organisation called Pura Vida in, in Guatemala. So for more information and for pictures it's best to, to see the Eyes of Gaia website.